Hi, Mr Corsi here. In this question we're asked to sketch the graph of y equals x minus 6 times x plus 4 and we have to show clearly points of intersection of the x and y axis and the coordinates of the turning point. So what kind of graph are we expecting when we graph this? If we multiply out these two expressions using first outside and size last, we get x squared, 4x, minus 6x, minus 24. And you'll recognise that this expression is a quadratic expression. And it has a positive x squared term. So we're looking at a graph that's shaped like a parabola, concave upwards, not concave downwards. If it was this one, we'd have a negative x squared term. So that's what we're expecting. Where does it cross the x-axis? Well, on the x-axis, y is 0. So we would need to establish the intersections with the x-axis by finding out when that expression is equal to 0. Now, this times this being 0, one or other of these two expressions will be equal to 0, or both could be 0. If this was 0, then x would be 6. If this was 0, x would be negative 4. So there we have the two points of intersection with the x-axis of this parabola. So it crosses at the point 6, 0 and the point negative 4, 0. So we can now sketch in that parabola. So the only thing that remains is these two points, the turning point, the minimum turning point down here, and the y-axis intersect. So that was the x-axis intercept that we worked out there, where y was equal to 0. And for the y-axis intercept, we set the other variable 0, set x equals 0, and that will give us the y-axis intercept. So we're looking at, well, let's take y equals x squared minus 2x minus 24. And setting x equals 0 there, this term is 0, as is this term. So y would be negative 24. So this point here is negative 24. x is 0, y is negative 24. This point, negative 4, 0, we're asked points of intersection, so we're as well putting the coordinates in on the graph. And the final one is this minimum turning point. Now, the symmetry of this graph would mean that the turning point lies halfway between negative 4 and 6. So halfway between negative 4 and 6 is 1. So this point here is the point 1, and what's the y-coordinate? Well, when x equals 1, y would be equal to, let's put it in this form, 1 minus 6 times 1 plus 4. So that's negative 5 times 5. That's negative 25. And we can check whether we've calculated OK by saying if OK, if this is at a height of negative 25, 25 units below the y-axis, and this point here is 24 units below the y-axis, that makes sense. Seems reasonable on this diagram. So there we have the graph of y equals x minus 6 times x plus 4. It's a parabola crossing at negative 4 and 6, y-intercept at 0, negative 24, minimum turning point, 1, negative 25. 
So that's Mr. Corsi signing out. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you.